simply go to www.psa.gov.ph online registration and then andito yung PSA help line.ph Ayan, so you may order your PSA birth certificate, certificate of live birth, marriage certificate, certificate of marriage, CINEMAR, uh, certificate of no marriage or request for, ayan, ayan, and then online from the Philippines Statistics Authority. Ayan, so less hassle na. Ayan, so nagdi-deliver sila uh, within Metro Manila and uh, outside of uh, metro manila ayan so andito yung steps para maka-start tayo uh, maka-avail tayo ng uh, kung ano man ang gusto nating kunin ayan so itatap lang natin yung get started and then so dito yung choices na birth marriage senomar and then death Okay, due to the enriched community quarantine, the delivery of your requested documents may be delayed. Ayan, so, i-click lang natin yan. I accept the terms and conditions and uh, uh, privacy policy. Ayan, so, for example, ang i choose natin is birth and then click continue. Then, I am requesting for the certificate of my self, your son, or your daughter or your parents ayan so uh, check lang natin kung alin dito yung i-request natin okay for example is yung uh, yourself ayan so piliin natin yung self and then continue ayan so click natin yung continue and then request your information ayan so kailangan lang natin mag uh, uh, mag-fill out, ayan so as the requester, you need to present your valid government issued upon delivery in the address indicated our courier will not release the PSE certificate to anyone but you, and then, ayan so, choose na natin uh, male or female, ayan, so for example, female ayan, so your civil status, are you a single or married, ayan, and then uh, your first name and so please make sure to use your maiden name ayan so then ayan so for example lang to ah uh, Ruth ayan so ayan so last name Morena and then next is yung uh, birth uh, date natin So, kailangan lang natin iset yung birth date natin. Then, kapag okay na doon, and then magsiselect ID type na tayo. So, andito yung mga possible na ina-accept. Ayan, so, Philippine Passport, issued by the Department of Foreign Affairs or DFA, and then Driver's License issued by the Land Transportation Office or LTO and uh, your PRC ID ayan, Integrated Bar of the Philippines ID ayan, your GSIS ID SSS ID or your UMID ID your Voters ID ayan, your Senior Citizen ID card OFW ID Overseas Worker Welfare Administration or UWA ID. Ayan, so Siemens Book. Ayan, in the National Bureau of... Uh, ayan, so pwede rin yun. And then Police Clearance, pwede rin yun. Ayan, so kapag nakachoose na tayo ng ID natin. Ayan, so continue lang natin. And then, please make sure your maiden name is spelled properly as it appears on your certificate of live birth. Ayan, so check natin yung first name natin. Ayan, ay, wala pala tayong middle name. So, kailangan natin lagyan ng uh, middle name ito. Ayan, so, for example lang to ha, Ruth. And, ayan, so, De La Cruz. Ayan, and then our last name and then click continue ayan so 
sabi dito, there is no father's name in the certificate of live birth. Kapag walang nakalagay na father's name sa inyong live birth, iti-check nyo yun. Pero kapag meron, uh, kailangan nyo ilagay yung uh, pangalan nyo dito. Ayan. Ayan. And then, yung pangalan ulit ng mother nyo. And then, yeah. Ayan. So, place of birth. Ayan. Sa so, Philippines. Ayan. And Philippines, and then select a province, and for example, uh, Metro Manila, and and then select your municipality, and so, for example, lang to ha, and so Pasig, and so click continue. And so, the certificate you are requesting for may not be digitized yet with a BSA. If it is was registered late, there is a chance that you will receive a certificate of negative intact of your continue. Ayan, was the certificate registered late? Kapag hindi naman, ang ikiklik natin is no, it was registered on time. Ayan, so, tinanong dito, ano daw yung purpose ng pag-request mo? Ayan, so... Uh, if passport, school requirement, or local employment, or foreign employment, marriage, or magiklaim ka ba? Ayan. So, was the very any legal proceeding done with a certificate? Ayan. So, please be sure with your answer because if you indicate none, but there was, you might receive a certificate without remarks or annotation instead. So, none lang. Ayan. And then, continue. Ayan. So, i-double check lang natin yung name natin and delivery address ayan so kailangan natin ilagay dito yung um, house number and street name your subdivision or building name ayan and then your province and your um, municipality ayan so napaka easy lang mag fill out ayan ng ano natin, para maka-request tayo ng birth certificate. Ayan. So, for example, Metro Manila. Ayan. Then, choose your city. Ayan. So, for example, Pateros tayo. Then, next is your, ilagay mo dito yung zip code. And then, your mobile number. And your email address. And then continue. Ayan. So, order information. Ayan. So, double check lang natin. And then dito sa baba, kung ilang copy ba yung uh, kukunin mo. Ayan. So, may choices naman dyan. One copy, two copies, three copies. Ayan. So, hanggang ten copies ang pwede. Ayan. So, ang amount na babayaran is 365. Ayan. So, pwede kang magbayad through... Uh, debit, uh, credit card, Gcash, Paymaya, 7-Eleven, yan, Bayad Center, Palawan, and then, ayan, so, uh, for example, ang, magbabayad tayo through Gcash, ayan, pay using Gcash, ayan, Gcash payment are credited immediately to your order, we will send you an email and SMS and confirmation after you Uh, payment, sabi dito. Ayan. Ayan, so pindutin lang natin or i-click-click lang natin yung uh, Gcash. Ayan, so sabi dito, log in to pay with Gcash. Ayan, so kailangan lang natin ilagay dito yung mobile number natin. Ayan. And then, wait natin yung uh, authentication code na iti-check sa ating mobile number. Then, i-click lang natin pay uh, 365. Ayan. So, make sure lang na may laman yung Gcash nyo. Ayan. So, your Gcash payment was successful. Ayan. So, dito sa baba, show delivery reminders. Ayan. So, pwede mo lang i-click yan. So, hanggang dito na lang ang video tutorial natin ngayon. So, I hope nakatulong ang video ngayon. Thank you for watching. Bye!